everyone! Welcome back to English Sunday School. This past Wednesday was the beginning of Lent. Lent is the period of 40 days that comes before Easter. During Lent, we spend time thinking about how God sacrificed Jesus Christ to forgive our sins. Today, let's continue our adventures with Moses by learning about the Ten Commandments. Are you guys ready? Let's go! God led the Israelites to a mountain. Thunder roared and the lightning flashed. The people heard a loud trumpet blast. Then God called Moses to the top of the mountain and said, I am the Lord, your God, who brought you out of Egypt. God wrote the Ten Commandments on two stone tablets for all of his people to obey. Do you guys know the Ten Commandments? Let's go over them together. Repeat after me. God is the only true God. God is the only true God. Never make idols. Never make idols. Never misuse the Lord's name. Never misuse the Lord's name. Rest on the Sabbath day. Keep it holy. Rest on the Sabbath day. Keep it holy. Honor your father and your mother. Honor your father and your mother. Do not murder. Do not murder. Husbands and wives must not commit adultery. Husbands and wives must not commit adultery. Do not steal. Do not steal. Do not tell lies. Do not tell lies. Never want what belongs to others. Never want what belongs to others. Good job! After receiving the Ten Commandments, the Israelites needed a place to worship. So, God showed them exactly how to build a special tent. It was called a tabernacle. God placed a cloud over the tent. Whenever the cloud moved, the Israelites packed up and followed it. And so, the Israelites continued to believe in God and travel to the promised land. But they were not exactly there yet. This week, let's think about the Ten Commandments that God gave us to follow. Have you been obeying all of them? See you guys next week. Bye!
today we'll do stick a boat. Let's go. our materials, we will need five gray colored papers, a pencil, and glue. Then, let's get started. First, take one of your colored papers and fold it like a door. Turn it sideways and fold it hard. Open it up. Then, fold one side to the center line and open it back up. Fold this in half again to the folding line and open it back up. Fold the corners into triangles and fold up one block. Turn it around and fold both ends into a triangular shape. Fold up the corner to the center line. The back of the Ten Commandments is done. Second, take another colored paper and fold it like a door. Turn it sideways and fold it in half. Open it up. Then, fold one side to the center line and open it back up. Fold this in half again to the folded in line. Turn it around and fold it the same way. Then, take the sides and fold them like a door to the center line. 
put the bottom corners into triangles. The front of the Ten Commandments book is done. Now take the two papers and glue them together. Use two more colored papers and fold them in the same way. Third, fold the last colored paper like a cushion. Leave one side and fold the last inward into triangles. Fold the remaining side inward and open it back up. Fold its tip to the center line. Then fold it in half. The connecting part is done. Fold glue the connecting part to the Ten Commandments. Lastly, write down the Ten Commandments in the book. Finished! Look! Today's final product! Did you guys have fun? It's really easy to make a book, isn't it? You can make it with your family at home. I hope you remember the 10 comments by carrying them around in your pocket. See you next week!